Hey, what it do is Jean Martez and you're now tuned in to First Class ENT. So I guess to the dot com. And she a beast, she a fuck with don't like to be called a hoe, but a freak on it. Hey, that's my little deal. 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 Hey, that's my Jay Bachelor Hip Hop Weekly Magazine. H Town, what up? Martez, what up? Yo, you know, it's, it's always cool to uh, kind of talk to the guys that are making their moves. But this is more like family here. Yeah. Cause you know, love, man. You know we, we always. I saw you at a party last night. You invited me over to your section. It was yeah, turning up. We was at the LeBron boy down. Yeah, Mr. People's downtown. So this is a situation where it's like I'm watching your moves, and but you're keeping me up to date. Like, yeah. You let me know yeah. when the new video shoots yeah. happening, yeah. when the new music is coming. So you know, for the people that aren't familiar. Tell us about yourself, tell them what you're working on, what you want to speak. Yeah, really, I go by Young Montez. I come from a group called NPS. Oh, wow, I bet we had the same crowd, that's not a deal. It was like one of the biggest songs out of Houston, like, like a song on to go. It was featured just being in Fat Pam, Big King, you know, coming out of Fit Ward. Shout out to my other, my other dollars, Corn, I don't know, man, Free Corn, too, man. Anyway, man, I just. I started to branch out as I, as I build my own relationships with different people mm -hmm. by being in a group. You know, I started to branch out and just start to just, you know, stand on my own too, man. Do your own kind of thing, but I want to hop back to that that song, That's My Little Dip, because in Houston, that was a big record. Yeah, yeah, right. And a lot of people don't know the role, the exact role you played in making that record kind of pop off. So really kind of tell them about that. I mean, really, you know, at first, like, I was the one who came up with the whole concept of that's what I do, mm -hmm. you know, and I originally, at first, when I first came up with it, the song was going to be for, for me by myself, mm -hmm. but when my, when my partners came home mm -hmm. from jail, and you know, once he came home, it was all back free mm -hmm. and ready to rap, ready to roll, so I had to put the song out here, mm -hmm. so I was like, you know what, this could be his song for the group. Yeah. So I put them out on her name, man. The rest is this, man. You know? Now, what made, what spurred the decision to go from a group member to kind of your own force, your own brand? I mean, really, I, I'm still part of a group. I'm still part of. We like, we, we don't have no bad blood. We're still together, but in the in the in the, in the time, the time frame when we was blowing up, that's not a deal. Mm -hmm. See, we didn't go out of the way because we had bad management. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So, with that being said, we were signed to a label. And he was also part of our management, and you know that ain't really how business go. You know what I'm saying? But tell tell people that because th there are guys coming up under you that they they don't know how yeah. the business goes, yeah. and you have to learn while actually living it. Yeah, I'm gonna tell you, man. Really, yeah. I, I mean, I could I could, I could give people the best advice all day, but the best listen is self listen. You know what I mean? And I ain't, and I ain't saying I want nobody to go through what I went through, but Man, you know. What would you do differently, though? Man, I really, I, I, I would pay more attention. I pay more attention to what I'm doing business with, mm -hmm. and I just trust that word verbally. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I pay more paperwork. Pay, we pay, pay real close attention, not just to that paperwork, but after you sign that paperwork, you pay close attention to what's what's being done from that paperwork. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Make sure people are still holding up to the part of the contract. Mm -hmm. Of that paperwork, you know what I'm saying? Because it still can go bad even after the contract. You can get that contract right all day, but if nothing is being done in that contract that you initially signed and agreed to, then you still have a problem. You know what I mean? So just like with anything, you, you during this phase, it has to be on point, yeah. which is the sign of the contract, yeah. and then the next phase with honoring the terms of that contract, that has to be on point too. Yeah. So you learned that lesson. Fast forward to now, you're putting out new music. You spoke at your old school recently. Yeah. You shot a video recently. Yeah. Tell us about um, when I calls you, my guy Propane. Tell us about that record. Man, really, I'm gonna tell you. I, I was in. I'm gonna be one hundred. I'm, I'm gonna be out of one hundred. I was, you know, that record inspired my last relationship. Inspired me to do that record. Okay. You know, I had a little shot. She was showing love, and I was just showing love back. And that was just one of my ways of showing love back. Mm -hmm. 
know, so everything I'm talking about in that record is really 100. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's not better today, but the time I created it, yeah. You know what I mean? So yeah. I, it, it ended up catching fire. I put out a mixtape called Ghetto Genius like a year or two ago. Oh, yeah, 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 oh, yeah. Seven, the producer. It's propane. Oh, First thing she holla, boy, I'm coming every time I call. Oh, feel like she go to war faster for me than my dogs. That's why I win it. Oh, my God. Oh, so he, he chose that particular. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's always a good look, in my opinion, yeah. when, when an artist says, I, I'm feeling this one. Let me hop yeah. on that. Because yeah. I yeah. think their, nat their, their natural, uh, what drew them to the record yeah. Yeah. is going to make them perform yeah. exactly. on it. Exactly. And you dropped it around the Valentine's. That whole Valentine's that video, yeah. the video came yeah. out Valentine's weekend. Yeah. Did, did your ex call after that? Did you call her? Was it like a, a rekindling? I mean, I mean, really, to be honest, yeah. it wasn't just about Valentine's, but she called plenty of times. You know what I mean? Oh, so, okay. You okay. Know, okay. <laughs> so, what, I mean, what's that? What's that relationship like when you are making records that kind of put your past relationships out there? How does that affect the person that was? part of that relationship? I mean, it could be a good or bad thing. Mm -hmm. and that's, it's really according to what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. It's really according to the subject matter, you know what I mean? Because, you know, sometimes songs can bring some emotions out, you know? Right. One song can tell a whole lot, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, but that being said, it just, it just all depends on the subject matter. Was she, was she like, okay, you, was she like, okay, you put us out there a little bit? No, she, no, no, to be honest, she was really honored because I spoke highly of her. I spoke highly of her being a woman for me in my life at the time. You right. know what I mean? So I'm pretty sure she still get emotional and think about some of the positive things she would done for me in my life, even mm -hmm. when she hit this record today mm -hmm. as we speak. You know what I mean? Because mm -hmm. she know what this, what, what this record was initially created from, how it was created, how it was inspired, and she had a lot to do with it. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So That's very dope, man. Yeah, um, yeah. So, so to the average listener that, that catches your stuff on the radio, because when I call has gotten love, on local radio, my little dip got a lot of love on local radio. They're like, okay, is this guy strictly making these female gear records? Nah, to be honest, right? Nah, I'm about to turn up and switch the whole mood. Mm -hmm. I got a single coming, probably like April, long say late April. Me and Kirk Bang, shout out to the club, it's a club. Shout out to Kirk Gold, all your liberty. I got a single coming. April, man. Just kind of think about it. It's like the car record, man. It's, mm -hmm. We on some China thing. We, you know, we on a whole nother. Okay. We trying to pop bottles. You know okay. what I mean? So, well, definitely. With that being said, man, I'm about to really try to knock up a little bit. Okay. Career period. You know what I mean? Most definitely. Yeah. Now, now, what's uh, what's your uh, relationship like with fellow artists in Houston? Of course, for pain, you and him work together. You and Kirko work together. Have you connected with the Slim Thugs? The Scarface is. Yeah, you know what? I'm, I'm actually getting ready to try to do some things with Scarface, like mm -hmm. as we speak. You know, that's in the making right mm -hmm. now. So we're trying to get a record knocked out together. Okay. Our people is getting at his people and they're talking in the conversation. The conversation is going a while on to go. You know what I mean? So very good. But I haven't uh I haven't linked up with Slim yet. You know, I, that's in my future. We talked about it a couple of times, but we just. Haven't locked in the thing in yet, but as far as propane, Kirko, right, Stunner Bell, Stunner Bell, you know, so it's, I'm talking about my dogs, man. They all show me love, and I always show love back, man. You know, I respect, I, I respect the respect, man. You know what I mean? Now, now, tell me this: Who do you think the ideal Young Martez fan would be? Like, who, who is your music geared to? My, I'm gonna tell you, my music is mostly for females. Okay. And the reason why I say that, you know, some Drake stuff. I ain't gonna just say the trick. I'm gonna say my tears. <laughs> I'm an old man, and we okay. make it before anything. You know what I mean? So Absolutely. I'm gonna say my tears, man, because mm -hmm. I, I mean, at the end of the day, we all have our different experiences and and, and our different lifestyles and different strokes for different folks. So I might we might be talking about females, but I'm I might see something different in what Trek might see. Absolutely. I might see something different in what you know whoever. You know what I mean? So with that being said, I'm gonna say my own style, but you know. To be yeah. too long, you know what I mean? Most definitely. Yeah. Tell tell uh, our people where they can follow you online, get us with that social media contact info. You can hit you can you can follow me online right now at we speak Instagram, Mr. Montez underscore MPS underscore. That's M R M A R T Z underscore MPS underscore. 
but also hit me on Twitter, same thing, without the underscore, M-R-M-A-R-T, right. underscore NPS. YouTube, look me up on YouTube, Facebook. He's on everything. Yeah, Young Montez, yeah. man, everything. Young Montez.com, just, just, man, look me up, man. I'm just holler at that, man, I'm going to holler back. Uh, can, they, can they check you out at South by Southwest? It's coming up later this month. Yeah, man, I'm going to be down in the lab in effect, man, so you know. I'm going to be here where I need to be. You know Have you been out there before? You performed out there before? No, I never performed out there before. I was out there last year shit for the first time. And just out there doing promo and just trying to get my feet wet. But this year, I plan on being one of the acts on stage, you know? Absolutely. Yeah. And you know, Hip Hop Weekly is at South by Southwest every year. So, you know, reach out to us. Let us know where we can find you check out your show, yeah. we'll come through, yeah. show love. you always show love back. Hey, another thing, man, man, go get this thing off iTunes, When I Call, man, When I Call by Young Montez on iTunes. I will be on MTV Jam Revoke TV sometime next month, so be on the lookout for that, too. Wow. Absolutely. On behalf of Hip Hop Weekly Magazine, I'm Jay Bachelor. That's Young Martez, and we out. Oh, yeah, 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 oh, yeah. Seven, the producer. Spro oh. Pain. Oh. First thing she holler, boy, I'm coming. Every time I call, feel like she go to war faster for me than my dogs. That's why.